didn't say it's not special with, with your kids. What's your uh, second or third district title with U.S. Cup? Uh, I've actually won six total districts. Six total? Yeah. I'm sorry. Five, five here and one at Strasburg when I was at Strasburg. Okay. Long time ago, okay. So. okay. Those other teams we talked about before, those are the teams that are the finals. Yes. Okay, that's very good. Yep. Um, as far as uh, just looking ahead, I mean, you don't know who you got, obviously. It's the winner of St. Vincent, St. Mary Alliance. You didn't play your team. No, um, we've been scouting them all the way through the tournament. We've probably seen every game. Uh, they've all played, so again, that's just a part of us. Obviously, we're going to get in the car and go down and watch that. we got other people wanting to watch the other districts, uh, district games. So, you know, it's just a matter of us, uh, again, trying to figure out as much as we can about them and, and figure out what we need to do to try to stop Were you a little bit nervous with the pressure they were applying at the end and the turnovers? Well, you're always they were nervous because they're so athletic. I mean, you know, they're, they're just quick. Uh, you know, and uh, you know, you, you got to handle the ball. You, you, you know, it's not so much your guard handling the ball; it's the guy coming back to meet it and making sure he's doing that uh, and being strong with it. So yeah, we finished well. We did that. So yeah, I was nervous. To him. <laughs> Any coach would be nervous at that. Point. They had uh, plenty of turnovers still. They didn't score off. Yeah, 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 defense, yeah. I mean, it's. I mean, we really talked. We talked with our guys. You know, they're going to be turnovers. It's just yeah, the way both exactly. play. I mean, they're very quick, very athletic, and, and they play intense defense. They rotate so well. Just yes, we talked about. We know that's going to come. We got to limit those. We got to limit or isolate the, the turnovers that lead right to a direct layup. You know, because they're going to get some of those, but you can't panic. You can't. You can't come back and have three, four of those in a row and give up four offensive rebounds on a couple shots too. Which I thought we did a great job on the boards. Scoring-wise, and your brothers and everything, so what does this feel like to have your brother next to you? So with you, Bob, I guess. Uh, you know, describe that, describe that scenario to me. I start getting goosebumps a little bit. You know, it's just an indescribable feeling of joy and excitement that I get to come out here every day and uh, play hard with my brother. You know, he learns a couple things from me every day, and I learn a couple things from him about each other and about our game. And, you know, it's just one of the best experiences I've had in my life. So. Michael, your, your brother's got a net around him. You both got medals. What does that feel like? This is probably one of the best feelings we've ever had all season, you know. Um, you know, at the beginning of the season, you know, we dreamed of, you know, winning this district championship, you know, and uh, a lot of people had doubts about us coming into this tournament, you know. Uh, we're not athletic enough or, you know, we're not quick enough, but, you know, I'm just really glad, you know, that we uh, proved a lot of people wrong, you know, we got this district championship. What was the turning point in this game? Uh, I think it had to say Marty Lee coming in and knocking in some big threes for us and, uh, you know, clamp down on defense at the defensive end. It's a game of runs. Basketball is a game of runs. Yep. We went on a nice little run there, and uh, you know we never really looked back from there. You know they cut it close a few times, but they never, we never, never let them get ahead of us. So I think that's a big part of Martin Lee coming in and hitting some good shots for us. Ironically, uh, you all your free throws before the quarter, no field goals. You guys are aware of that? Not until, uh, uh, not until just uh, now. No, <laughs> it's us. kind of weird. Um, have you had a game like that that you came out on top and won that you had no field goals? Before? No, I'm sure we probably have, but you know, I mean, it's kind of weird, yeah. You know, yeah. just want to talk. That's that's how you win games, you know. Uh, once teams start fouling, you know, you just you gotta start knocking down free throws, you know, and that's what we did. You know, that's what we did. Okay, first regional appearance for both of you guys, right? Your dad said this is the fifth time since he has gone to the Yeah, and he was once at Strasbourg. You guys alive then? Or I was. I was. Obviously. I was like one, I think. Okay. I can't remember. Are you how old now? I'm 18. And you're 16, 16. 16. Um, anything else just about uh, about that run? You guys, I think, went on a 17, 4, 16, 5, something like that in the second Right there, almost four half, yeah. Yeah, right before half. What'd you guys do to turn over like that? I just, I, I, you know, I guess, you know, our dad told us in the timeout, you know, previous, you know, we just got to settle down. Just, you know, uh -huh. those pressure, you know, was starting to make us turn the ball over a little bit. He just told us, you know, to settle down a little bit. And, you know, once we started settling down and started playing our game, everything else just fell through. What did you guys do to prepare for the speed and the, the transition game Bukto had, uh, of course, forcing the turnovers today? Uh, well, we actually did most of our practice was playing against six of our JV members. We had six members on the court, you know, constantly trapping, constantly chasing us around. So playing against six defenders is, is hard, but it's very, really hard to simulate the speed and quickness of Bukto, but that's what we did, you know. Send our JV players, I give them props, they come in every day and practice and play defense for us the whole time. They're really helping us out and they're doing a great job doing that for us. Uh, looking ahead, uh, what do you guys need to correct or, or fix to uh, move ahead and keep this thing rolling? Cut down on turnovers. I don't know, we had 11 in the first half, I think. 
you know, we cut down our turnovers and uh, clearly, I mean, we didn't make a field goal in the fourth quarter, so come in, be strong with the ball, make sure we get into the bucket making plays, so that's what we got to do to cut down turnovers.